the Holtby Stakes. Next up then, uh, this is a small field two-year-old race. It's over 10 furlongs on, so a long way for the two-year-olds to go. It's a 0-70 though, and at the top we've got Kipthorne Rosegen for CDJ Liggett going for a quick fire double. The Indian boy for OB1, Arco Bellino, Martin Liedham, Keeping Fleet, James Shea, and White Caviar for Satyam. So all five should take home a little bit of prize money. There'll be a lot of it in this 0-70. Uh, a win is a win is a win. And away they go. A little bit slow out was Arco Bellino, but quickly got over that. And the grey-white caviar pulling for its head is a pretty much suspected or expected leader. But keeping fleet has come around the outside to try and challenge it. But it looks like white caviar's probably going to go on. Although this may be the all-time rarity of a Satyam horse that has got the lead and doesn't want it. And uh, it looks like it's going to be keeping fleet that goes on. So this could get tactical two-year-olds over ten furlongs with nobody wanting to make the pace and keeping fleet is the early leader from white caviar the grey on the inside of the yellow jacketed the indian boy and then the purple and white stripes of arco bellino on the outside and finally the top white clip thorn rose gen who's just at the back and it's keeping fleet it's keeping the lead and it's too clear oh, arco bellino in second and then white caviar is third the Indian boy fourth and clipped all Rose Jen. Just the back marker of the five as they make their way down towards the final five furlongs. Uh, keeping Fleet is an undisputed lead. For Marco Bellino and White Caviar. Then the Indian boy and clipped Thorn Rose Jen. Keeping Fleet then. Continues to lead by three, Arco Bellino on the outside being pushed along his second. The one that's cruising through there is the Indian boy. And it's going through to take a share off second now. White Caviar just being pushed along to stay with those two and coming around the outside. Clip for Rosegen. It looks like he's going to try and go past them all and swoop through to challenge for the lead. And that's exactly what's happened. And Clip for Rosegen has quickly gone on into the lead. Then from last to first in a matter of strides. And he's suddenly a couple of lengths clear and cut right across to the fence as well. Jockey seems to have a complete plan with that one. Knows exactly what he's doing. They hit the final furlong. And Clip for Rosegen is too clear of Indian Boy second. Then keeping Fleet White Caviar. Arco Bellino is out of it. But it's Clipthorn Rosegen who stole this with that manoeuvre around the turn and wins it easily from the Indian Boy second white caviar keeping fleet and finally the disappointing Arco Bellino at the back and a quick fire double for CDJ Liggett. I think from memory of the forums it's Connor Liggett but we'll continue to call him CDJ until we can be sure. So there it is, a good win there. For CDJ Liggett, Indian Boy second for Obi Wan, White Caviar for Satyam third, Keeping Fleet for James Shea fourth, and Arco Bellino was fifth.